This is the instruction video for the three act story that you're going to break down your movie, your story. You're going to break down uh, using Adobe Spark into act one, two, and three. So uh, you'll find that here in this folder. Okay, so here are the instructions, the summary of the instructions that we're going to be going through right now. So you're going to have five slides total, a title slide, a credit slide, and then slides to support act one, two, and three. You can do more than one slide for these if you want, uh, but minimum of one for each act, okay? I think on act two from my story, I want to have to show you two things. All right, so uh, I've got to go to Adobe Spark. We're going to Adobe Spark. Adobe Spark. Okay. And we're gonna do a video, so slideshow. And we're gonna skip this. And we're gonna start from scratch. So I've already gone and got my pictures. You need to go on the internet first and get images for acts one, two, and three, okay? From your movie or your whatever story you're gonna tell, all right? Uh, and if it's a book and they didn't turn it into a movie or a story, I mean, an animation of some sort, you might have to sketch your own act one, two, and three, okay, from the story. But uh, we're starting with the title slide here. So uh, let's see, let's go find a theme. So my theme, I think, will be flare. Let's go with flare. And let's go with blues. Okay. And for the layout, um, I need title and text for this. Okay. So for the title, it's going to be the name of the story, whatever it is. So Cinder. Cinderella. Okay. And then here you're going to put three act story. Okay. So that's going to be your title, your title, but I want you to put three act story underneath it. If you have an image that you want to open with, and I do go ahead and get it. So I'm going to go to video uh, photo here and I'm going to upload a photo. So I've already saved the photos to my drive. And so go to images and there, there are my recent images. So here is, I got this called Cinderella zero for the opening slide. Okay. So there it is kind of, kind of like a summary of the movie, right? So I'm doing that. Okay. Then I'm going to add another slide and remember you can pause, rewind, fast forward to this training video to get, you know, so that you're doing it while you're watching it. You do a little pause and then watch a little more pause Do it, you know, so you're working with the video is the best way to do it. Okay. Uh, so here I need a photo and I need a caption. So I'm going to go down here and go to caption for the layout. So this will be my act one. Okay. And then I need my photo for act one. So I'm going to upload photo. And that's going to be here. I called it Cinderella one. All right. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and add, so that's all the text you're putting in. I don't want you to, to write your summary. I want you to say it. You're going to use your voice and that touches. Well, let me finish. Let me build this thing and then we'll do the voiceovers. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to hit plus and now this guy, I need a caption. I need to call this act two. Act two. God. All right. And I got a picture for that. Now here for act two, I've got a couple of photos. I think it took more than one photo to kind of. So first we'll start with this one. I think this is when the fairy godmother is helping her get ready. Oh, no. This is when she's dancing with her prince. Okay. Right. So she's dancing with the prince. She goes to the ball. Remember 
the invitation to the ball came to the house, but she didn't get to go because her evil stepmom and evil stepsisters, right? But she ends up going with the help of a fairy godmother. Obviously, I will narrate this on and record this. Uh, so that's act two. And then I got one more slide for act two. And I need a caption. And I need to put act two. And then I got another photo, upload photo from the computer. And here's my second supporting image for this act two. So this is when she fits her foot into the glass slipper to be identified as the woman that ran away, right? Uh, making the prince happy. And then we have the last slide for this act three, I should say act three slide caption. And photo upload photo. Okay, so here is Cinderella th act three. Okay, so Here's the ever happily ever after. So the denouement of the movie is always a, in Disney movies. A lot of times kiss. And now they're all in trouble for it with Snow White on the ride. You guys read about that. Uh, so uh, anyways, that gets us our three act structure. Then I'm going to go to credits and I'm going to put something clever. Just end it with something clever. If you can't come up with anything, just put the end, right? I'm going to put happily ever after dot, dot, dot. Uh, created worth work by me. All right. So just put your name here. that will identify it as you. All right. So now the last thing I need to do is do my voiceovers. So on the title slide, no voiceover, right? Title slide, no voiceover. It's going to be slide, the act two, one, two, and three that you need voiceovers. You don't need a voiceover for the credits. You don't need a voiceover for the title slide. Uh, but here you need a voiceover. I don't see any text except act one, act two, act three. That's it. Okay. So, uh, and also, doesn't this, does this not tap into a universal truth that all of us don't like our voices, especially when you're, we're younger? We all just don't like our voices to hear our own voice. We hate it, but you know what? Your voice is wonderful. Never be ashamed. Never be, uh, sad. you know, I shouldn't say ashamed, but never be, uh, frightened of your voice or never, it's not the right thing either. Um, never think your voice doesn't sound good. Cause they do you guys, everyone's voice sounds good. I felt the same way when I was younger. Oh, we all feel this way. That's why it's a universal truth that we don't like to hear ourselves talk. Uh, when we're young, it's just, this just way it is. Okay. So, but you got to do it. You got to push. You only get better. You only get over these things when you practice, 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 and you realize it's no big deal. And you realize you have a beautiful voice. Okay. So here we go. Act one. Let me see. I'm just going to throw this together real quick. Um, uh, so the story starts with Cinderella, who's treated badly by her stepmother and three stepsisters. Boom. Okay, then we go to the second one. All right, here we go. And remember, you're clicking and holding down while you talk. And then wait, a, pause for a second after. With the help of a fairy godmother, she goes to the ball, meets her prince. After having to leave the ball quickly at midnight, uh, the prince is able to track her down from the lost glass slipper that fits only her foot. And wait a couple seconds after the end, because it's the very last part of the video. The video seems to chop the voice off at the end. So make sure you hold down. Make sure you hold down. Make sure you hold down the microphone and after you stop talking. Okay. All right, and then the final scene is the denouement, okay? And now we're gonna click and say, and now that the princess found Cinderella, 
they get married and they live happily ever after. And here's where I want to pause a little bit and then let go. Okay. And that's it. And then you download it. You go up here and click download. So we're moving too fast. So let's let it finish saving. Now it's ready. Now it's doing the download. Once the download is done, I want you to submit that to this assignment. Submit the Adobe Spark dot MP4 to the assignment. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to take the time to show you that part because obviously this is taking a while here to do the download. Uh, but um, you've done this before, hopefully. So we are good to go. All right. You're going to submit the MP4 video file to this assignment. That's almost done. I guess we'll let it wait. We'll wait for it to finish. Yeah, we're almost there. I'll probably take this little part pause out of the training video. All right, so there it is. So now it's downloading. See, it's downloading to your Chromebook. It's downloaded. So now if I go to my files and downloads, there it is right there. And I can right click over it and rename it if I want to and call it three act story, which is what I want you to call it. And then you're going to go back to the assignment, click up here, submit the submit button and browse to that file and turn it in. You guys got that? You got that? Period 6 is listening and helping me do this. Thank you, Period 6. So now 